Kid Craddock in the morning. As football season is winding down for the guys, uh-huh. the equivalent to the football season for the ladies is just getting started. America's most eligible bachelorettes Hi. meet the man of their dreams. How are you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you look fantastic. Thank you. It's not easy to give a first impression rose when you have all pretty good first impressions. How am I going to do this? Honestly. <laughs> she is he looked amazing. You're really strong. It could be the body, it could be the hair, could be that accent. Love your dress. Thank you. I saw something in him that I know that I could see for the rest of my life. I absolutely never thought it was going to be this hard. Isn't it kissing? It's hard to watch someone that you're connecting with connect with other people. I can't even imagine like how much harder this is going to get. Oh, it's going to get way harder. Brutal. <laughs> it's going to get brutally hard. Juanuary <laughs> has officially kicked off, mm-hmm. which means The Bachelor season 159th. It's starting up or whatever it is nowadays. So it premieres tonight, right? It premieres tonight, and to help us out and guide us along is Reality Steve from RealitySteve.com. Welcome and Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you guys. How you doing? We're doing, doing great, Steve. So what was the purpose of this show last night, it, since it starts really tonight? Yeah, it was uh, It was the first time they've ever done it. It was an introduction to Juan Pablo is what they called it. So they introduced you to you, be, you introduced you to him because uh-huh. barely saw him last season. Yeah. He, so he nothing. was a contestant last season yeah. on The Bachelor. Yeah, Bachelorette. exactly. Okay. You don't even remember because no. he was barely shown. He was on six episodes and he was barely shown. They're building this guy up to be bigger than, like, the Pope. I'm surprised yeah. there's not, like, white smoke coming out of the top of the mansion. <laughs> well, well the, the main thing with him is that it's just his accent, right? That's what the girls like? Yeah, it's all... He's foreign? It, it's all uh, style, no yeah. substance, What does he basically. do for a living? He works for the Venezuelan Baseball Hall of Fame. <laughs> but wasn't he a professional joking? soccer player? He was, he was a professional soccer player, but now he basically, uh, his job is to go to all the Major League Baseball teams and talk to the Venezuelan players yeah. and then That's all of report back to, and then like take their batting gloves and, and bats and gloves the and, like that. So he gets and gives them back to, the, to put in the Venezuelan Baseball okay. Hall of Fame. That's a great job. That's what he does. Well, here's really? one. Wow. Here's, that, that is a great job. That sounds pretty cool. He gets <laughs> to go talk to professional baseball players all the time. How many Venezuelan professional baseball players could there possibly a lot. be? Oh, I think we have Name a Venezuelan one. baseball player on the phone. Name, right who's the most famous <laughs> Venezuelan no. professional baseball player you know? Hello. No. <laughs> hello. Hello. Hey. What's your name? Uh, uh, Rodrigo you? Santana Montana Venezuelana. Oh, okay. So, he was the baseball. You know, who do you play for? For the Dodgers. <laughs> the I'm lawyers. Sorry, the Dodgers. The Dodgers. Do, do, Dodgers. The Dodgers. The Dodgers. Los Angeles Dodgers. Okay. <laughs> so before this bit goes really bad, we're gonna go ahead and hang up with you now. No, I don't right. know what part of Venezuela you're from. Oh. Caracas. Can I, that's yeah, the only Caracas. city you know. <laughs> that's the only city you know. Go ahead and admit it. Adios. Adios, amigo. <laughs> All right, how about that? I think that would be a very limited career run was, yeah. for Juan Pablo. Okay. Hopefully this will parlay into something should else. Ask yeah. him. Should ask him if he knew Juan Pablo. Oh, Is right. this at least a more attractive crop of people than we've had in the last couple seasons? Because that's really the only reason I like to watch. Yeah. I mean, I, I think there's some good-looking girls this season. It's t- They went with 27 instead of 25. I don't know why they chose 27. Because the first 25 were B. <laughs> he was like, can you throw an extra two in? <laughs> but I, I think that they, uh, I think, that there's some good looking girls this season. How many obligatory black girls are there? Uh, one. One. Okay. Yeah. okay. Thank you, Bachelor. One. Wow. Does she make it through the first episode? <laughs> they, no, of course they, she does. They never, they never eliminate her the first week. <laughs> yeah. no, she they not. get her into the mansion uh, and then eliminate her. Always. You can't, you can't eliminate she the only black it, person. She makes it through week. the first night. She, she does. She See? does get a rose the first night. See? Does, yeah, she's hopeful. Yeah. 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 And a, lot, a lot of people had a problem with, because Juan Pablo didn't really have that personality shining through on yeah. The Bachelorette. And does he develop that at all this season, or is he kind of Manila? Doesn't matter, Jason. Yeah, I, I, I don't think they're really centering the season around a guy whose English is his second language. Well, what are you mm. talking about, Steve? Because Juan says he's trying to learn to talk gooder. I have been practicing my English. I used to say words. Now I say words, things. Everything is better pronounced. I've been speaking a little slower, so you can understand me at home. See? He goes things. Then he goes oh, everything is everything is better from that. Oh man! Wow. Get a whole season of that. Congratulations. Are they gonna have subtitles on him like on Ho- Honey Boo Boo? <laughs> well, yeah. there, there's definitely some subtitles because so many girls coming out of the limo tonight. At least I want to say four or five Try say something in Spanish. Spanish. Yeah, oh. and of they course do they do. Yeah, and um, hola. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's about as far as they get. Yeah, como esta? Uh, but I just you know it's I think I I just look at the show as. 
you know, the same thing every season. Just so are you cast. defeated at this point? You look a little beat down. It's, it's just, completely beat. You look, it's, it's a, beat down, Steve. It's a job at this point. <laughs> That's how I look at it. It's a job. I don't, I don't How's get excited your 2014 about it. looking <laughs> reality scene? Yeah. I mean, I don't I don't get excited about the show. It, it's Lucky just too. It's so formulaic. That's yeah, why. Yeah, exactly. Problem. It's the same thing every season yeah. with different people. So you get a you get the firecracker girl. Who's going to cause all the drama? Yeah, you got one of those? Drunk. You got one yeah. of those. You have the drunk on the first the episode? You got the drunk on the... F- well, they don't show it, but... You yeah, have the one that talks about her ovaries expiring? <laughs> uh-huh. No, they actually showed that last night, apparently. One <laughs> okay. Of, one what's, of the girls. what's the odd thing that the girls bring? Like, the one person, like the egg, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What girl comes in with an odd prop uh, tonight? The biggest, the oddest prop tonight... Well, I would say there's two. Number one, some girl comes in on a piano bike. I saw that. What's, a, preview that? Of that. what's yeah. a piano you're, you're on a bike... With, with a, piano? a piano, and you're as it's you're what it as is. you're pedaling, you're playing the piano. Oh, wow, the piano girl. that's pretty good. And then one of the <laughs> stupidest intrigued. gimmicks that I've ever be seen. Trying to, JC will be trying to. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want to split. Throw that in with <laughs> a split. Yeah, I'm gonna do a split. <laughs> <laughs> Learn to play the piano. Yeah. Like, um, and then the second thing, which I think is one of the dumbest ones, and there have been some dumb ones. Dumber than the show. piano bike. Dumber than. Some girl comes out of the limo with a fake prosthetic, seven months pregnant. Like the word, like did he, did he actually think that they were going to cast a woman who was carrying someone Maybe, else's yeah, child? I mean, like, I've known guys so have dumb. things for pregnant women. Does I don't she, know. does she fake give birth right there? <laughs> <laughs> that would be good. I mean, it's just, a little baby. It pops yeah. out. A little, a little don't baby. worry, it's just girl, jelly. Water girl breaks. That got out of the limo wearing the wedding gown. Made final two, didn't she, or was she final three? Yes, final she two. did. Final two. Yeah, and that was was that <sighs> Sean Lowe's season? Mm-hmm. Speaking was, of, yeah, getting married. This wedding's actually happening. Yeah, wedding January twenty sixth, Sunday night, live, two hours, Ugh, which is really weird. Two hours, two hour li- a live. What? We- like they've done Dude. three weddings before. They uh-huh. did Jason and Molly. They did Ryan and Tristan. They did Ashley and JP. They were all taped, and I think they had all of them had seven to ten days before right. it aired. This one, and they're doing live, really? like two so hours. So many things can go wrong if, on a live wedding and like commercial breaks can back and out. stuff. <laughs> so I can faint in two yeah. hours. Have, you know how many weddings do we hear about people just standing up there, and the pressure and the heat, whatever it is, and they just collapse. Well, you know, yeah. <laughs> so do you know what happens at the end of Sean's wedding? Yeah, yeah. he's no longer a virgin. <laughs> yeah. So good. Yeah, I wonder if they're gonna get to that part. If they're yeah. just, they're but just he's gonna... really looking forward to that Sunday. Yeah, I was gonna say Sean must be just counting the days till January twenty sixth. Yeah. and finally do it. January twenty sixth. Now, 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 back back yeah. to the show. Yeah. Um, I heard you say something about this year they're doing something on Sunday on a regular basis. Just like in the, the show is still on Monday. Yeah, just on just on uh, just in January. Oh, okay. yeah. So oh, good. This so last night we had this introduction where they actually. I mean, they did something they never done before, which was they showed footage from the casting process, the girls meeting with the producers. And Who's that dude? Was that the, the presentation? Like you're going to be on the back, so from the producer that you yeah. don't see, you just see this hand <laughs> with a rose. That's probably who they see way more yeah. than Chris Harrison. Yeah. That's who they but were like, working with every but, day. But it was like this, Kelly. You've been chosen to be on The Bachelor. And That's there's it? a camera, <laughs> and they, you see this mysterious hand handing a rose to the girl. And yeah. the girls are like, this is supposed to be so impromptu and surprised. One girl answered the door in a red gown. Yeah. But she had no idea. But she had no idea. Does Chris Harrison, the host, hook up with any contestants this year? No, as far as I know. Not yet. The season's not over. Yeah. Yeah. Well, 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 Steve says he already knows who wins. (laughs) Oh, yeah. Oh, they've already gone that far in the process. It's over? Oh, it was over in November. So he's he's serious? done. Bachelor, but no, Bachelor is always the same. Bachelor tapes from September to November and then airs in January. So he's got a may or may not have a winner. I thought for sure that we would maybe get a little bit of oh no lap overlap. <laughs> no, Bachelor. The Bachelor lag time is a good six weeks before from the end of filming to first episode. Mm-hmm. Bachelorette is a little quicker. What tropical that, location did they end up at? Uh, the the overnights and the final rose ceremonies in Saint Lucia. Mm. Oh, Saint Lucia, which w- they've done once before. They did on okay. Jake's season. Jake and uh, and Vienna. We're down in St. Lucia. That went very well one. for them. Yes, it did. Yeah, <laughs> they even had a public breakup at the mansion with Chris so, Harrison. He is engaged. Who? Juan Pablo. Juan? I mean, if you, if he's already over, the show's over. Yeah, he does. <laughs> He doesn't want to ruin it for people that are wanting to watch. I mean, do, we, do we want to talk about this, or do we want to do go to the side? Is that spoiling it to say he's engaged if you don't say we pick? No, because sometimes the, the big ender is he doesn't pick anybody, yeah. or they don't get engaged. or or. Okay, so here's the deal. If yeah. you want to know if he's engaged and who it's to, you can, you've can. you already got that posted. Yes. How how uh, What's the percentage on how sure you are? 
Because last year you I said. Know. I mean, it's it's. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to tell you it's 100. Okay. And I, know, and I know it's 100. percent I know this is the ending of the show. But uh-huh. I said that last season, and then I was on the very next day to tell you guys, wow, I was wrong. But <laughs> you, you're what we call so, a liar, Steve. Yeah. <laughs> so nothing really I say, and and I've even mentioned this to my readers. I mean, I can say here's how it's going to play out, but. There will be people that want to hang on the fact that I was wrong Wanna. last season. <laughs> I see what you did. Yeah. They want to hang on the fact that I was wrong last season, which is which is fine. I mean, I guess I'll just be vindicated when the yeah. finale airs. But no, this one is, I mean, I can just, I'll say it. It's it's right. Well, I don't want to know, so please don't, don't go on my face. Everybody. I'm sure someone will tweet you, Kelly. Kelly, when people. you tell people not to do it, they do it. But they do it. I'm, I'm just telling you. I'll, it's more fun for me because I live tweet it yeah. on yeah. Kelly Raspberry 2. I don't want to bother people who don't want to follow it. You go to Kelly Raspberry number two, and I'll live tweet it. But I like the whole being able to <sighs> yeah. not know. I you, don't want to you know. You know what I want to do this year? What? The, the last couple seasons, because I don't really watch the show that much, I, I'll bust into my roommate's room halfway through the season and tell her who wins. <laughs> and video Why are we now, show? now I want to go to like a big watching party with a bunch of girls, because I know girls get together on Monday nights to do it. I just want to show up at a watching party like I'm there to watch and then just be like, this is who wins. Well, you should do it and then take well, it. We should do yeah. it. Yeah, we'll yeah, do it should. at the bar. Let's we'll do it at the bar. We the Bachelor the Runner. Reaction. Yeah. You'd never make it out alive. Oh, she would. No new friend. Jenna's feisty. <laughs> is there going to be a dance between the two of uh, a couple with a, in a town square and a Michael Bolton type artist comes out singing? <laughs> of course there is. Uh, uh, well, who's the artist, I guess I should ask? Yeah, I Anybody? think. Um, oh, Cheesy or good? I'm free. I, one of the the guy that finished second on X Factor, Josh Krajic. So wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, it's getting a reality worse. show is now Kragic? got. got yes. <laughs> reality show is X reaching Factor out win. to other reality shows. <laughs> Has he got Ned bad? Yeah. He's, uh, the he's rock the guy? performer on the first. Yeah, the rock. He was on the first X Factor. Yeah, Josh Krajic. They've gone from train to the guy that was <laughs> yeah. like the third runner up on what happened? X Factor. And is then there, there's another guy. Uh, is it country guy Billy Currington? Oh yeah, he's good. Okay. He's he's, good. he's on an episode. He performs. Um, Do they have anything that that's any drama that, that we, like a girl has a boyfriend back home and he comes in or anyone remotely interesting? Anything that we got to look forward to this season? <laughs> I think. I mean, you got dates and girls cattiness in the house. That's uh, different. There's no boyfriend drama this no? year in terms of. You know, back home. Or Nobody anybody, hooking apparently. up with production assistants. Nobody hooking up with production. Um, this is shaping up to be the lamest <laughs> Bachelor in history. They need to throw another element in there, like make it Hunger, it's over. Hunger Games style. You know, <laughs> but it's like over. They, they, the girls they fight don't other? get food, no. or there's yeah, death they, is an option. See, they need to yeah. take it and do the it in Venezuela. Out. Yeah, in Venezuela with some of that unrest going on down there. Uh-huh. Then we might get some excitement. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't. Wow, I don't I really was know. So enthusiastic until you got here, Steve. Because <laughs> Chris Harrison said this is going to be the mo- most amazing yeah. season most amazing ever. Season they, ever. They, they always yeah. say that. Yeah, but, I mean, I think they're really focusing on Juan Uribe. Yeah, and just the fact that Juan this Bible. is our, our first non-white bachelor. Mm-hmm. Um, we got something like, hey, everybody, we got something different. Hey, you we know, got a guy that speaks. Yeah, we got a English Venezuelan a second guy language. Yeah, exactly. Got mm-hmm. A non-white guy. Yeah, so shout <laughs> out. Pipe down. Pipe yeah. down there, minority. <laughs> There's a pipe down there, minorities. Well, no, that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to get somebody on there this night. Pipe down there, minorities. <laughs> Can we hashtag that? Well, if you want to know who wins, and you want to find out any ba- behind-the-scenes scoop or scandal, which doesn't sound like there's much, but at least you can find out who wins, you can go to realitysteve.com, because he's got all the scoop on there. All right. Exactly. And on other shows, too, right? Or is it just all well, Bachelor yeah. right Spoiler now? wise just this one. And if you want to see the black chick, watch tonight. Yeah, what? Don't, <laughs> and, and don't blink. Yeah, don't, don't wait for blink. <laughs> watch tonight. Subscribe now for more videos from Kid Craddock in the Morning. And check us out at kidnation.com. It's Kid Craddock in the Morning.